If the president can no longer serve, who becomes president? The vice president. The House of Representatives has how many voting members? 435. Name one of the two longest rivers in the United States. Missouri River. Mississippi River. What is freedom of religion? You can practice any religion or not practice a religion. What does the judicial branch do? Reviews laws. Explains laws. Resolves disputes, disagreements. Decides if a law goes against the Constitution. Name the U.S. war between the North and the South. The Civil War. The war between the states. What is the name of the Speaker of the House of Representatives now? Paul D. Ryan. Paul Ryan. What ocean is on the east coast of the United States? Atlantic Ocean. What was one important thing that Abraham Lincoln did? Freed the Slaves, Emancipation Proclamation. Saved or preserved the Union. Led the United States during the Civil War. Who wrote the Declaration of Independence? Thomas Jefferson. Who vetoes bills? The President. How many amendments does the Constitution have? 27. What does the Constitution do? Sets up the government defines the government, protects basic rights of Americans. What are two rights in the Declaration of Independence? Life, liberty, pursuit of happiness. What is the rule of law? Everyone must follow the law. Leaders must obey the law. Government must obey the law. No one is above the law. What did the Declaration of Independence do? Announced our independence from Great Britain declared our independence from Great Britain, said that the United States is free from Great Britain. What did Martin Luther King Jr. do? Fought for civil rights. Worked for equality for all Americans. Name one branch or part of the government. Congress. Legislative. President. 
Executive. The courts. Judicial. Who is the Chief Justice of the United States now? John Roberts. John G. Roberts, Jr. Who makes federal laws? Congress. Senate and House of Representatives. U.S. or National Legislature. The idea of self government is in the first three words of the Constitution. What are these words? We the people. What do we call the first ten amendments to the Constitution? The Bill of Rights. Under our Constitution, some powers belong to the federal government. What is one power of the federal government? To print money. To declare war. To create an army. To make treaties. How many U.S. senators are there? One hundred. Why does the flag have fifty stars? Because there is one star for each state. Because each star represents a state. Because there are fifty states. Who is one of your state's U.S. senators now? Answers will vary. District of Columbia residents and residents of U.S. territories should answer that D.C. or the territory where the applicant lives has no U.S. senators. What is the supreme law of the land? The Constitution. What is the highest court in the United States? The Supreme Court. What are the two parts of the U.S. Congress? The Senate and House of Representatives. During the Cold War, what was the main concern of the United States? Communism. How old do citizens have to be to vote for president? Eighteen and older. What is one right or freedom from the First Amendment? Speech. Religion. Assembly. Press. Petition the government. Name one U.S. territory. Puerto Rico. U.S. Virgin Islands, American Samoa, Northern Mariana Islands, Guam. Who does a U.S. senator represent? All people of the state. What stops one branch of government from becoming too powerful? Checks and balances. Separation of powers. In what month do we vote for president? 
November. How many justices are on the Supreme Court? Nine. What is the name of the Vice President of the United States now? Michael R. Pence. Mike Pence. Pence. Name one state that borders Mexico. California. Arizona. New Mexico. Texas. What is the political party of the president now? Republican Party. Name two national U.S. holidays. New Year's Day. Martin Luther King Jr. Day. President's Day. Memorial Day. Independence Day. Labor Day. Columbus Day. Veterans Day. Thanksgiving. Christmas. Who is the commander in chief of the military? The president. What is the economic system in the United States? Capitalist economy. Market economy. Who signs bills to become laws? The president. What is the capital of your state? Answers will vary. District of Columbia residents should answer that D.C. is not a state and does not have a capital. Residents of U.S. territories should name the capital of the territory. If both the president and the vice president can no longer serve, who becomes president? The Speaker of the House. When was the Constitution written? 1787. There are four amendments to the Constitution about who can vote. Describe one of them. Citizens 18 and older can vote. You don't have to pay a poll tax to vote. Any citizen can vote. Women and men can vote. A male citizen of any race can vote. What is the capital of the United States? Washington, D.C. We elect a president for how many years? Four. What is the name of the national anthem? The Star Spangled Banner. What major event happened on September 11, 2001, in the United States? Terrorists attacked the United States. What does the President's Cabinet do? Advises the President. 
What is one responsibility that is only for United States citizens? Serve on a jury. Vote in a federal election. Where is the Statue of Liberty? New York Harbor. Liberty Island. Also acceptable are New Jersey, near New York City, and on the Hudson River. What is the name of the President of the United States now? Donald J. Trump. Donald Trump. Trump. What movement tried to end racial discrimination? Civil rights movement. Name one right only for United States citizens. Vote in a federal election. Run for federal office. What are the two major political parties in the United States? Democratic and Republican. There were 13 original states. Name three. New Hampshire, Massachusetts, Rhode Island, Connecticut, New York, New Jersey, Pennsylvania, Delaware, Maryland, Virginia, North Carolina, South Carolina, Georgia. Who was president during the Great Depression and World War II? Franklin Roosevelt. Who is the governor of your state now? Answers will vary. District of Columbia residents should answer that D.C. does not have a governor. What did Susan B. Anthony do? Fought for women's rights. Fought for civil rights. What is an amendment? A change to the Constitution. An addition to the Constitution. Who is in charge of the executive branch? The President. Why did the colonists fight the British? Because of high taxes, taxation without representation. Because the British Army stayed in their houses, boarding, quartering. Because they didn't have self-government. What are two rights of everyone living in the United States? Freedom of expression. Freedom of speech. Freedom of assembly. Freedom to petition the government. Freedom of religion. The right to bear arms. Name one war fought by the United States in the 1800s. War of 1812. 
Mexican-American War. Civil War. Spanish-American War. When is the last day you can send in federal income tax forms? April 15th. Who did the United States fight in World War II? Japan, Germany, and Italy. Who is the father of our country? George Washington. When must all men register for the Selective Service? At age 18, between 18 and 26. When do we celebrate Independence Day? July 4th. What is one promise you make when you become a United States citizen? Give up loyalty to other countries. Defend the Constitution and laws of the United States. Obey the laws of the United States. Serve in the U.S. military if needed. Serve do important work for the nation if needed. Be loyal to the United States. We elect a U.S. representative for how many years? Two. What are two ways that Americans can participate in their democracy? Vote. Join a political party. Help with a campaign. Join a civic group. Join a community group. Give an elected official your opinion on an issue. Call senators and representatives. Publicly support or oppose an issue or policy. Run for office. Write to a newspaper. Name one problem that led to the Civil War. Slavery. Economic reasons. States' rights. Name your U.S. representative. Answers will vary. Residents of territories with non-voting delegates or resident commissioners may provide the name of that delegate or commissioner. Also acceptable is any statement that the territory has no voting representatives in Congress. Who lived in America before the Europeans arrived? American Indians. Native Americans. Who was the first president? George Washington. When was the Declaration of Independence adopted? July 4, 1776. Why do some states have more representatives than other states? Because of the state's population. Because they have more people. Because some states have more people. 
What happened at the Constitutional Convention? The Constitution was written. The Founding Fathers wrote the Constitution. What do we show loyalty to when we say the Pledge of Allegiance? The United States. The flag. We elect a U.S. Senator for how many years? Six. What are two cabinet level positions? Secretary of Agriculture, Secretary of Commerce, Secretary of Defense, Secretary of Education, Secretary of Energy, Secretary of Health and Human Services. Secretary of Homeland Security. Secretary of Housing and Urban Development. Secretary of the Interior. Secretary of Labor. Secretary of State. Secretary of Transportation. Secretary of the Treasury. Secretary of Veterans Affairs. Attorney General, Vice President. The Federalist Papers supported the passage of the U.S. Constitution. Name one of the writers. James Madison, Alexander Hamilton, John Jay. Publius. What territory did the United States buy from France in 1803? The Louisiana Territory. Louisiana. What group of people was taken to America and sold as slaves? Africans, people from Africa. Name one war fought by the United States in the 1900s. World War I, World War II, Korean War, Vietnam War. Persian Gulf War. What is one reason colonists came to America? Freedom. Political liberty. Religious freedom. Economic opportunity. Practice their religion. Escape persecution. Before he was president, Eisenhower was a general. What war was he in? World War II. What is one thing Benjamin Franklin is famous for? U.S. diplomat, oldest member of the Constitutional Convention. First Postmaster General of the United States, writer of Poor Richard's Almanac, started the first free libraries. Who was president during World War One? Woodrow Wilson. What ocean is on the west coast of the United States? 
Pacific Ocean. Under our Constitution, some powers belong to the states. What is one power of the states? Provide schooling and education. Provide protection. Police. Provide safety. Fire departments. Give a driver's license. Approve zoning and land use. Why does the flag have 13 stripes? Because there were 13 original colonies. Because the stripes represent the original colonies. What did the Emancipation Proclamation do? Freed the slaves. Freed slaves in the Confederacy. Freed slaves in the Confederate States. Freed slaves in most Southern states. Name one state that borders Canada. Maine. New Hampshire. Vermont. New York, Pennsylvania, Ohio, Michigan, Minnesota, North Dakota, Montana, Idaho, Washington, Alaska. Name one American Indian tribe in the United States. USCIS officers will be supplied with a list of federally recognized American Indian tribes. Cherokee. Navajo. Sioux. Chippewa. Choctaw. Pueblo, Apache, Iroquois, Creek, Blackfeet, Seminole, Cheyenne, Arawak, Shawnee, Mohegan, Huron, Oneida, Lakota, Crow, Teton, Hopi, Inuit.